You're basically a Colombian whore. You're a Colombian whore. This is some Joker v. Joker. Man, if I want to steal, man, you know, listen, let me let me teach you something. I should have got that's you the truth. Kind of snake. You're acting I don't like you your money. If you you're, 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 you're a, you're a, you're a, a perfect example. Marquette, Devon, Burton, Saints, and the Saints. Oh, and today we got something special for you. This man right here, of all the people I've roasted, no one has ever had the the gall to reach out to me, which I appreciate because I'm not a passive aggressive man. I'm an aggressive yeah. and I always come direct. So I can appreciate when someone comes direct. So that's number one. You're the first one. I want everybody to know that everybody is scared. They never. Re oh, he actually went to his. Or I not went to his studio, but he's actually talking to him live. I didn't know that. Oh, sh reach out. You know, for everybody in the chat, you know, I did call him a scuff TI and I did tell him on our private calls, like, listen, bro, I did call you Scuff TI. All right, my bad on that one. You said you apologize for saying I'm a Scuff TI. Oh. TI. Honestly, that doesn't affect me at there all. Go. Have you ever been on Valley Tame? Have you been out there? I have not. So the Asian girl, her name is? Angela. Her name Angela. is Angela Knight. Angela Knight, all right. So one thing I can say about Angela is one, she, she came for you in a very direct, aggressive way on a consist there was like no way to be confused she was coming for your throat now why didn't you just basically say all right yeah bitch i said you're fat and you're still fat god damn it i stand by it like why <laughs> the tap dance well first of all i never called her fat the, oh the original statements which oh, they were finally sent to me uh i have oh, to read them out to you here um but there were three chat messages that i sent on a passive time uh, uh, live chat that I don't remember she was. All I said was, I said three things. First thing I said, who is this chubby woman? Second message is, ha ha ha. Third message is, she's about 40 pounds too heavy for me. Ah. That's, okay. that's the three, and I can send these messages to yeah. you. If you, want. No, you don't have to send that. I'll take your word for it. I'll say that about adds up to saying she's fat. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's about what that adds up to. Uh, would Myron say that you're his mentor? Yeah, Myron was the one of the first students in my 2019 <gasps> no uh, original shot. course, Body Language Mastery. And then from really? there, we became business partners working into 2020. And then the data we used when we made uh, a course called Pandemic Pickup, we found out like the formula to what gets the maximum amount of views on YouTube. And he was able to take that formula and make the Fresh and Fit podcast. <laughs> gotcha. Let's go ahead to no uh, what you said Myron. about Marquette de Bomberg. So this is your stream that was sent to me. Uh, this is at three hours, 14 minutes. We're gonna click play and see what you say. Not not a good luck, bro. Uh, no, somebody says, you and St. Sinner have, I don't even know who this guy was. Somebody sent. You know what I hear a lot? I hear a lot of people say, not people, I hear a lot of you. I don't know who this guy is. People get so mad when you say, I don't know who this guy is. I have to be really careful when people ask me like, do you know this guy? And I'm like, I don't know. But I don't mean that as an insult. I generally just like, I play video games. I play my piano. I argue with people. I don't know anybody. Because <laughs> people get really, really, really mad when, when you're like, I don't know who somebody is. YouTubers say, I don't know who this guy is, but in every case, invariably, they all know who I am and they're lying. Is your story that you had never heard of me up until you got that super chat? Uh, so what happened was somebody sent me the live stream of the, when you were live. Uh -huh. uh, or the, I don't know if you were live or whatever, but it was the live stream of you criticizing my uh, my appearance on Value Tainment Money. Yeah. And that was when I first had seen it. And then that was the first time I ever like seen your channel, seen who you are. Ooh, so he didn't know you. So I just want to confirm, your story is that up until that super chat, Ooh. you had never seen me or heard of me. Uh-oh, no, so, uh, does he no, ever see saying otherwise? That, I mean, somebody told me you did some crypto stuff, and then somebody told me you... Let's uh -oh. talk about that, because uh -oh. that's funny. We're actually going to play the clip where you say that. Before you did that, Angela, 
handful of police men who have worked to become high-value males to have sexual discipline. She is engaged and is probably worried her man may realize the worth of exercising options. I, I can scarcely remember which of these chicks is which. Which was Angela the Asian one? Yeah. Oh, okay, that's what's up. Do we know if her man is Asian or white? I don't know who she is. Okay. Do you know? I, don't, I just found out who this bitch was after she freaked out on me on that stage. Got you. Based on stereotypes, I'm saying he's either Asian or white. But anyways, let's, let's go back to uh, let's go back to you. At his stream, uh, of where I where with where Federico's name was there. Okay. So uh, I don't even know who that guy is. I heard he was associated with some gigantic crypto scam. So that's yeah. ooh. So let's talk about that. I find it strange that you would say you don't know who I am, but you would say I'm associated with a gigantic crypto scam. Mm -hmm. What crypto scam would that be? Ooh. So I have a I have a live chat where Frederico and I were in, right? And one of the guys in there, I put the screenshot of this the same screenshot that I sent you, where uh -huh. you can see the super. Listen chat. to how weak. It's kind of funny, I guess. If we, if we want to be like, we can go full Britney. We can analyze this through like top bottom dynamics or whatever. MLD has come to Sane and Sinner expecting that this is going to be like a friendly conversation, and you can see kind of how submissive he acts in like this conversation like oh like he's like i haven't i haven't watched the whole video i just know that apparently they start fighting but you can tell that mld is like whoa whoa bro 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 i didn't know anything about you um somebody in my chat like told me this thing and 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 it, it might not be even true so like yeah i'm sorry if i said that like i didn't i didn't even know if that was true or not that's just a thing i heard like he's about to go full bitch mode down that path oof that being don't give me, give me the right, that's my guess i could be wrong we'll see summary give me the summary of where you Give me the summary of the evidence of what you're talking about. Somebody said you did a saint and sinner's coin and then you did a rug pull on it. Somebody yeah. said that. Oh, okay. yes. So would that be factual or would that be hearsay? Uh, I guess hearsay, right? Because I haven't looked it up. Yeah. And also, what are the chances that they would have that information? It's not hearsay, but okay. Like, uh, random person. He sent me an internet archive thing. Yeah. So here's here's what I'm saying. The only person on the internet that's ever made up this lie, there's only one person. Do you know who that is? I know you know. Will you admit to knowing who that is? There's no, only one person. I have no idea. Is Go your ahead. former friend Destiny? Wait, did I say He's that? The one who made that up. Now, Wait, did I say? I'll did I say? Wait, are you talking about me? Did we ever accuse him of crypto scam? I don't remember. We might have. I we truly might have. I don't. I don't remember. I do think it's friend was a scammer with the the dying friend in the hospital to watch i think we did oh wait is he the guy that did the rug pull on like the two thousand oh i remember we did say this okay okay funny times funny times I'll tell you another thing that's comical about it you know how much he said the rug pull was for like two thousand no. dollars you don't know oh so you you mentioned you basically accused me of something but you don't even know how much you don't know anything about it though correct okay so the rug pull was supposed to be for $2,000. $2,000. My sneakers are $2,000. Mm -hmm. Do you know how much of an astronomical waste of time it would be to try to make $2,000 right. for me? Moreover, I find it disheartening in as much as you're suing a couple people right now, I hear. No, he's stream, not. Right? He's not. Okay. Presumably for slander or libel or something like this? Defamation. No. Defamation. Kind of in the same category, right? Uh, I don't know. I'm just suing. Yeah, defamation is when you defame someone, which would be to make them look bad, presumably, right? With things that are not true. W would that be about accurate? Okay. I mean, correct me. Correct me if I'm wrong. I mean, my lawyer's handling this, so I don't know. Okay. But just that the, that's what we're suing. You don't know what defamation is? Uh, yeah, well, he just doesn't like have a lawyer. He stuff. doesn't have a lawyer. He's not suing anybody. All of this is not true. Something to make someone look bad, right? Yeah, something that's defamatory, right? Mm -hmm. Defamatory. Let, let, let me see. Defamation. I'll look it up for the both of us since we're both goofy. I'll look it up. Defamation. I'm just going to get the definition here reads the act of damaging the good reputation of someone slander or libel you might recall i used the term libel just seconds ago right mm -hmm. 
So that being the case, you're suing multiple people for defamation, which would include slander and libel. Right. Which is to say they've made up things about you presumably that are not true, right? Correct. So then you go on your stream and you say something about me that is definitely and clearly not true. Okay. So there was no rug pull? He's not even going to answer it. <laughs> Number one, there was absolutely no rug pull. Oh, okay. He did, Number he did. two, Good job. you sound like a fool to even ask me that question. That's kind of true. I'm just asking you. I mean, you're, 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 because you're, because like, like, you're, you're kind of like a, why would you, you answer like that? Cool to even ask the question. Okay, listen. I've been, no, listen. I've been winning for a long time. I've been winning for a long time in the public sphere. You see, you can use the Google search engine and see I've been winning for a long time. You'd have to go back decades, like over a decade, for me to have a necessity to try to make a quick dollar. Mm -hmm. What were you doing before YouTube? I was working in the medical device industry. As an employee. <laughs> medical device. Yes. I'm sorry. I, okay. sh I shouldn't make fun of it, really. Which was not. He was the guy in Pursuit of Happiness. <laughs> what was he going door to door trying to sell machines to people? What does that mean? The reality was he was probably a con artist. I think both of these guys are probably con artists. Case for me. So when you get on and ask something stupid, it shows that you wouldn't even do the basics of Google, yet you would sue someone else for libel and defamation. What really it seems like was probably the case is that they hurt your feelings. It's not that they defamed you, it's that they hurt your feelings. Mm -hmm. And I tell you what, another thing you said on your stream and I can, I can play it just in case I might remember incorrectly, which is possible. But I could have sworn you said that you would knock me out or you would beat me up or something like that along those lines. Did you say that? Knock you out or beat you up? Yeah, like, <laughs> like you said you thing. would fight me or something. What? Am I imagining that? I might have imagined. I might want the fade, so I might be imagining. But let me know. Did you say that? I don't think I said I would knock you out or beat you up. Okay, let's, let's see. Let's see. That's all I know. But I really don't pay, like, what am I going to pay attention to some, like, Ooh. skinny looking dude? <laughs> ah, uh -oh. we go. So we got a couple things we got to address. So you said pay attention to some skinny looking dude. If I was standing next to you, you think I would look skinny or you would look skinny? Uh, well, how much do you weigh? <laughs> You're about 5'8", five, right? 5'10". Five you're about five foot ten. Mm. I'd be towering over you, and I have way more musculature. Mm. So if I was standing face to face with you, you look like a sixth grader. You okay. look like a little kid. And I'll what's more you. than that? And what's more than that? You start asking me dumb questions or playing stupid. I would beat the Smack brakes out. Up. Of you. I would beat the brakes off of you. And I'm in Vietnam right now. You're in Japan. You said that you're a rich man. <sighs> you you did Myron's first deal. I invite you to Vietnam because Vietnam is less litigious than Japan. You understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So if you think that I'm a skinny guy, you fly over to Vietnam. And I tell you what, if you win the fight, I'll fly you back first class. Ooh. If I stood next to you, you wouldn't say a peep because I'm a scary person to someone like you. <laughs> and let me also tell you this. If someone defames me or slanders me or, or commits libel and I have an issue with it, I wouldn't sue him. I wouldn't need to sue him. Because I've done things you'd be scared to do <laughs> in real life. We don't measure. It's like two, like, it's like two, no offense. It's like two losers having a measuring contest with each other. Like, it's so much false bravado from both of these guys. It's actually so f funny up on any way and one thing i told you when you reached out to me via phone i'm not about creating enemies i had never met you when i spoke on you if you're calling me and it's all peace and you don't want me to make the video tonight i'll end the video no problem i won't even do it if you're coming in peace if you however are coming talking about you want to sue me or or any tough talk I encourage you to sue me, and I'm definitely gonna make the video, which lets you know the kind of person I am. I'm hyper aggressive. I have zero fear, and I'll destroy everything that you love. Right. So you, you, you gotta tell your audience what I said, though. 
you said some words that did not answer my question, which my question was, you want me to not make the video. I was offering you an olive, an olive branch to not make the video. And then you just started becoming verbose. And then I invited you to come on here. Mm. And you Actually, come on here. Collaboration is my idea. Was it your idea? It was my idea. Yeah. Remember I said, it's because you asked me, you said, do you want me not to make the video? I said, listen, do dude, I, I don't care about that? YouTube. I'm here to okay. call you and talk to you man to man. That's what uh, I said. Man I said to I'm man. not going to try to tell you how to run your business and you don't seem like a guy who f takes in orders from people anyways. Right? See you. He's That's trying to suck up. You don't seem like and a guy. And I said, how about this? You seem like an we honorable do a man. collab and we talk about this like and we men. fucking build a bridge. Aww. That's what I said on the phone. I think that your memory is errant or mm -hmm. you might just be emotional or confused or maybe you're emotional then. I don't know. But either way, here we are. And the truth is that we had a cordial conversation. I thought we had a very cordial conversation. Right. But what, what I would never right. tolerate is there, there are two things that annoy me. And I always encourage my audience never to lie because lying is actually difficult. It, mm -hmm. requires, <laughs> it requires something greater than intelligence. It requires levels of manipulation, levels of pretend, a good memory, a whole bunch of things. I encourage people not to lie, especially when you're trying to lie to someone who's brighter than you are. You won't fool them. So when you play Actually games true. with me, like, did you do a rug pull? I mean, don't be a fool. Where'd you go to university at? Who the f are you? Like, if you check my background, my background is vetted. There's no reason to pull a rug, uh, pull a rug for any amount of money, not $2,000. If I ever pull a rug, it's going to be for hundreds of millions of dollars. <laughs> I only play big. I don't do anything other than play big my whole mm -hmm. life. If I win, it's going to be big. If I lose, it's going to be big. I wouldn't waste time doing something that could scarcely buy me a pair of sneakers. You make yourself look like a fool to even ask me that. Now, who are you though? Where, where did you go to school? You were selling medical devices as an employee before YouTube. And where'd you go to school? Uh, University of Central Florida. University of Central Florida, which is Shitville U, right? No, it's University of Central Florida. Right, it's Shitville U, which is to say it's not even ranked on the top tier of schools. So you went to a shitty university, then you got out and you got a basic sales job, which is the easiest. Are schools typically ranked if you're not talking like law school? I've heard like top five law school, top seven law school. Um, and then I've heard like a Ivy League, but are schools ranked like in general? Graduate schools have ranks. Yeah, of course, sort of. Medical schools are also ranked. Like, I'm trying to think, is there like a ranking for like state schools for like undergrad degrees? I guess maybe, huh. seems kind of weird. I've never heard that outside of like, I've never heard somebody brag about their undergrad, except for, uh, I say for law school, but technically law school, well not technically, law school's not an undergrad, I guess, I don't know. Fucking job to get sales. Mm -hmm. And then you get into YouTube, lying and scheming your way up like a bunch of fake have done. Oh, I didn't lie and scheme anything. Yes, you did. Uh -oh. Yes, you did, because everything about you is a lie. Uh oh. No. Everything that's about you is a lie. That's, that's why you true. got framed by that Asian girl because you couldn't come clean and say, Yes, I called you fat. Ooh. You tried to hide. And the weird thing is, why would you hide from a female? I oh. didn't remember her. Dude. Oh, true. It's just a woman. Dude, I'm telling you the truth. You didn't why remember what she wrote? No. I just told you five minutes ago, it's my first time seeing those messages. How do you even tell what level the weapons are? Oh, requires level 27 and 26. Oh, ew, they're bad. Okay, weapons it is. It's nonstop, dude. You think I sit around and just remember these things that I write in these chats? All right, let's see what else you said about me. It looks like a scuffed TI. I don't even know the f guy. He was saying like, I don't- One thing I will say about that piece right there, I like that effort though. I like that effort. Cause strangely, I like to be made fun of cause I never got made fun of when I was in like elementary high school and all that good stuff. So I like to be made fun of. I like that you attempted that. So I do appreciate that. That was, Thank I you. appreciate that. I don't have frame. I'm not in my masculine, whatever. I'm like, all right, bro. Cool. This is probably fuck a better you, weapon, bro. right? I don't know the I fuck think it you is. are. Oh you yeah. You can say it to it my is. face too. Then you call the police. Say it to my ah, face. There we go. Ooh, yeah. That's so smart. I did not say so you said if you could say it to my face, let me ask you right now, the I way you perceive though, me. That I was going to knock you out, as you previously accused me of. We know you're I'll play the whole clip and we'll see. I'll play the whole I clip and we'll see. I already reviewed the whole clip. It was 36 seconds from okay. the one hour, 35 minutes, and th zero, zero mark to 36 seconds. And that's when it stops. 
And you, and you you're forgetting the part at the beginning of it when somebody says, "Do you and Saint and the Sinner have beef?" And I said, "No." There, that's right. Because you know why you can never beef with me. Do you know why? Do you know why you can never beef I with don't me? I want to beef with you, Marquette. Because you, it's Marquette, number one, Marquette, and number two, sorry. you could never beef with me. I'm sorry. You, you could never beef with me. Sorry. We're not on the same level. We're on sorry. radically different levels. Mm -hmm. You should be terrified. And let me tell you this, furthermore, you said, would I say that to you in, in person in front of your face? Boy, I would spit in your motherfucking face and you wouldn't do a damn thing in real life. <laughs> You think, that's real being good, you think that's being a good role model to men, saying you're going to spit nah, my don't face? Don't say that right now. Don't <laughs> say that to me right now. You think I, I, you're saying would I say that I to your face? I called you no, right don't change, now. Don't change personality. To make a peaceful your personality that we just, brother. No, 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 no. Your personality you was just now when you say that to my face. Okay. This was you. This was you. Listen. You're saying, like, I don't have frame. I'm not in my Listen, masculine. Whatever. I'm like, all right, bro. Cool. F you, bro. I don't know who you are. You can say it to my face too, then you call the police. Okay, good. That's you. That's you right there. Yeah. Now, I just want to make sure because a lot of people say they're savages when they're really a nice guy. Mm -hmm. Me, I know that I'm mean and unpleasant. That's why when you called me, I said, hey, if you don't want it to be smoke, it's no smoke. Because I realize that I'm hyper aggressive. And I realize that when it's an enemy situation, I go all the way. So do you in your real fucking life believe that I wouldn't tell you this to your face? Do you do you really believe that? At the time, I didn't know who you were. I'm talking about right now. Well, right clearly now. now, it's very evident you're aggressive and you have something to prove. Ooh. You know what? The question is, would I say that to your face? Yes. Yes. And you know what? Just like P. Diddy said, you would take that. If I said it to your face, you wouldn't do shit. And let me tell you something else. I saw some footage of a guy walking behind you, filming you, and your mom was there. You know, and you were like, hey, man, stop filming me. Yeah, I saw that footage. You know, yeah, if my mom was there. You don't know what you're talking about. If you, if if you my, see anything about that footage right now, if, you're going to look like if, a fool because you don't know what you're talking about. If my mother was there, if my mother was there, she would have stepped aside and said, beat his ass. Bro, you I don't would never know. let anybody disrespect me in front of my mother. My Bro. mother wouldn't let anybody disrespect me in front of her. I have a case right now because of that. The dude is a pussy. He pulled out his phone and started f recording me. It, is it is it pussy to start suing people though? Like no, like off of some defamatory shit? I'm suing him because he's f pressing charges against me. I have a case now because he's suing me for assault. Listen, let me let me, let me tell you the truth okay. of the story, okay? This okay, so if, you, if there's cases going both ways, you don't have to get into this. I don't, no, no, I don't no. Like I'm gonna give you the truth because you're putting me. Listen, you're painting me out like I'm some fucking bitch ass little fucking dude. You are. Like, no, no. You, you might not be a bitch, but you're not this a bitch ass, and I don't you like the way you're talking. You you I'm trying to explain the thing to you, but you're framing this conversation to try to make me look bad and flex on me and look good in front of your audience. No, cool. no. I would do this in per and I do this in person. I do this in private. So regardless, when somebody run me you gotta let me get my point across here. Okay. The guy, listen, the white guy there, all right? The white guy Why does he gotta be white? has been talking shit about me for months, okay? And he's telling everybody, and if you watch the entire clip I have, it's chapter five on that live stream that I sent you, and you can see the full context. And he was talking shit for months. I'm gonna knock you out on site. I'm gonna KO I'm gonna KO you on site. I'm gonna f you up. I'm gonna knock you out. And talking shit, and talking shit, and talking shit. So I saw him by the Megaro River outside, and I pushed him to the floor, and I said, "Right, you've been talking all this shit. Now what's up?" And you know what he does? He pulls out his fucking phone. He starts recording me, and he starts saying, "Kei satsu yonde kudasai," "Kei satsu yonde kudasai," which translates to, "Somebody call the police." Somebody called the police. That's the situation. I was not running from a fight. He was running from a fight. And if you watch the full details covered in the five hour long live stream, I was not running from shit, sir. Well, I did watch the video, which was on your Can channel. I leave? And okay, it looked like this. you were there with I'm your done. mom. I give up. And it looks like you were retreating away from him. That's what it looked yes. like. And what I'm, tell what I'm telling the you. Police. What I'm telling you is I would have the fuck out. 
Right. So if I would have knocked him the f out, then I would have been doing. I would be in jail right now if I did that, because that's not how the laws work in Japan. Ah, uh, I, I see. So that's another I would good be in, reason. Mark, Mark Pet, I would be in f jail right now, dude. And then my mother, who was visiting me, would be left alone in a foreign country while I'm there in prison. And that's another reason that you shouldn't say that people like me wouldn't say things like to people like you to their face. Because you know what? Okay. As I said, I would have socked him the f out. And like all that other, all that extra explanation, I would have been in jail and all that other shit. The reason he pulled that on you is because you're weak. You see, he'd have to be scared to pull some shit like no, that on me. Because I'm not going to out. No, no, no. He no, no, no. He did not pull that weak. on me. Wait, wait. He so let me see you with your mother. Okay. You're, 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 you're putting yourself as some like intellectual superior person to me. So you're really? saying you went to Central Florida University. No, no, no. Well, we're talking about the context of the conversation right now. You said that because this guy, I pushed this guy. If, let me ask you something. If I pushed you to the floor, would you stand up you and start recording me? Listen, you would you start? Right. But if I did, would you stand up and start recording me with the phone and say, somebody call the police, somebody call the police? Because that's what that guy did. Listen, we don't have That's that what on he footage. did. You know, answer my question. If I push you, you to the floor, would you call the All police? All we have on footage is you retreating. No, you, you no. have the wrong footage. Your computer must be broken. No, I saw the footage on your stream. No, because the context of the conversation was this. I told I got, you. I, got another... I pushed him to the floor. Okay? I pushed oh, him is... to the floor. Oh. And on the front end of the video, listen, no, no, you're, you're pretending to be Mr. Superior Intellectual. Listen, if, he's, if you watch the video, he says, All the data indicates that I'm intellectually What did he do to me? He said, All what do you do to me? He, he hit me, didn't he? He hit me, he hit me. That's what he's saying in the video. That's fine. That, that, that's no, 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 don't, don't, don't tip toe away point. now. Don't, has nothing to do my <laughs> don't tip toe away. You were yes, with your does. mother and you got disrespected. Yes, it does. No, 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 You're backing off now. You're backing off because you're wrong. You're you backing up is wrong, and you're banning people in the chat who are you calling you out. You were scared, and you're oh. making excuses. That's all I was is. not scared at all. Why would I be scared? You just said that you were scared to go to jail. Yes. <laughs> and you didn't do anything, so you were scared. That's my whole no, point. No, 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 no. I got okay. another, I got another, so, uh, listen, another I was thing scared to go to jail, but I was not scared of that guy. Okay. Maybe you're okay with doing jail time. I'm not. That's another reason you, you should never bring up people like me, because if you would ever approach me with my mother there, I would consider that to be a tremendous offense and I'd beat the f snot out of you. Right. And here's the thing. The reason he approached you is because he knows that you are pussy from head he to toe. He didn't approach me. He I approached him, Marquette. Marquette. If you approached him, why was Marquette, he able to you get up and start recording? Why you weren't was he there, bro. I'm telling you. Recording? I so approached you him. You approached him off some sandbox shit like a toddler. You pushed him and then just like walked away. That's weird as shit. You don't think no. so? No, I pushed him away and then he away. stood up. Yeah, when you push somebody, you push them away from you. W was he approaching you or did you, your initial story was you walked up on him and pushed him. Like yes. you were confronting him. Yes. Now that's weird. What, what was the purpose of that? I thought the purpose of that was to like go ahead and throw God, hands. Bro. Why didn't you throw hands? Are you, bro, are you are, like, are you not listening to me? I told what you the, the reason I pushed him, him is for months he's saying he's right. going to knock me out. He's going to okay. kick my ass. So okay? you pushed him for what purpose then? Because he was talking shit for months. He's going to beat my ass. And he posted my photos on the internet saying I'm a fag, oh. all this shit. I talking see. shit. Listen to me. He's talking shit since July 29th, 2022. And I my understanding of a masculine on April man, first. My understanding of a masculine man is not that you go up and you push someone. My understanding is you go up and you knock them the fuck out. That was my understanding. I didn't know you Model go sucker punch face. people. Okay. You, you also <laughs> punch them when they're facing you because your mom was right next to you. He was walking towards you and you, you didn't do shit. I pushed him. All right, that's cute. Anyway, so let's hit these super chats. I got one more item for I you. I did from push him. Though. Said, I've been defamed all my life by these haters, never sued anyone. I'm a short king. Listen, I'm a short king. We have Major Minus Salsa just showing appreciation with this beautifully polite destruction. You feel me? I am polite. And Sacred Carter said, don't ever fake the funk. A real one may call you out. Peace to the saints. And I was trying to be polite too. Like, that's the only things that like, I don't like sneak disses. On Cash App, we have Justice said, go forth like a fearless lunatic and BB. Yeah. We have Ron said, tuition. What do I see? And my. Kevin said, please, camera, don't hurt him. Um, 
Oh, I got another clip uh, with you and Sneeko because you might be aware. I know you said you, you'd never heard of me, but you might be aware that um, Sneeko's a bitch. Uh, and, and, you know, he, he had some words and, you know, so we're not on good terms. So let's hear what you said about Sneeko. I, I hear you were defending him being a cuck. I hope that's not true. Let's take a look and we, we could just chop it up about that real quick. So I got 15 minutes in, 15 seconds. Let's see. You know, like the whole thing that with about you being the, the whole cuck thing, right? You went to a swingers club, you your girlfriend slept with somebody in front of you, and people. We did a, I did a couple swap, and I hated it. We stopped, and I said on the podcast it was traumatizing. I hated doing it. Yeah, but yeah, I mean. So the thing is this, right? You made a mistake. Did you forgive yourself? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Damn, bro, that was cute. That was like some. That was a motherfucking Doctor Phil moment right there. This man said. You made a mistake. Did you forgive yourself? Okay. Like, that was like some big bro shit right there, man. Um, do you think it's all right to, you know, pass around your girl like a, a slobbery blunt? No. So you don't condone any of this shit then, huh? No. Because it kid sounds like... A, dude, the kid made a mistake. He was like 20 when he did it. That's see, cool. where I'm from, you know what percentage of people made that mistake? Zero percent of people. Well, like, dude, that's I'm sorry, we're not all as perfect and almighty and super educated and as rich as you, bro. I'm so sorry. I'm oh, so sorry. Yeah, the victim, he's the victim now. I like this shit. You're a victim. No, you have uh, a massive ego, and that's going to catch up a, with you. I have a tremendous ego, and yeah. you know when it comes out, it comes out when people like you start bullshitting me. Nobody's yeah. bullshitting you. I've been honest here's, from the get-go. Here's the thing. No, you're not an honest man. You know what's bullshit? When we, were on the, when we were talking on the phone and we were you're being man-to-man man and talking about having a peaceful conversation and now you're trying to turn this into a gigantic gotcha moment? That's no, bullshit. You know, There's no, no you know, honor in what you're doing. The reason why that happened There's no is honor in what you're doing. You can, you can try to be like this cool lying. guy, but there's no. No, at, at the end of the day, there's no lying. honor in what you're doing right here. No, here's why. You started lying. I said you were... In a situation Where's where you're suing center someone. Coin? Hold on one second. I got Where's you. Where's the same center coin? Said, hold on. I got you. I said you were in a situation where you're suing someone for defamation. Okay. If that's the case, why would you say something about me that you know to not be true? And then you asked me, oh, did you do a rug pull for 2K? I'm like, see, now we're playing games here. I didn't say and for 2K. I I don't play. Games. Okay, but listen, if this is what you want to do, you want to do a TMZ. The Saint Center guy, legitimately mentally ill. He sounds like one of my, I, I think it's a really, really, really big dose of narcissism. Would be my guess, but I don't know him personally, so I can't really say it. Like I could with like Mr. Girl. He could also just be like a scam artist, con artist. He might make money like having this kind of like false bravado. But like I said, I think like anybody that's legitimately successful or has experienced any level of success in life can see two con artists. Um, when when you see them, like nobody that's successful acts like this. You don't need to say that you're successful. Um, when you are successful. You don't need to carry yourself like this. The only type of people here that are so obsessed with projecting an image of success uh, that they have to act like this are people that aren't successful. That's why they try so hard to project the image, right? Because that's all it is, is a facade. Gotcha moment, that's fine. We can make it. You're, we you'd have this. to be a star for that to happen. You're a yeah. scared guy who called me because you were scared and you were right to be no, scared. Listen, and I'm not scared. Been you gonna, you're gonna hunt me down and kill me? It would have been a peaceful conversation, except that you started bullshitting me. You start bullshitting. Me. If you, you know, if you'd have never started bullshitting me, it would have never went this way. Because the whole conversation, it was reasonable, wasn't it? Up no, until that started, started because you started talking about me in a bad way. I started pointing out accurate observations of the fact that you're not who you pretend to be. You're a sheep in wolf's clothing. No, I'm not. You, yes, you're, you're not, you're not smart enough to even think the truth of what you're I said. A sheep in wolf's clothing. You said I walked off of valuetainment in frustration. Listen, you yes, were no. there getting flamed by four girls, and you, you, so you listen, you're, you're Mr. You smart IQ at all these universities, you were right? You're, 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 you're so secure you in yourself. You're these the things. entire internet made a if number of videos so smart, about you looking bad. Why didn't you pick up the context of why I left? If you're so smart, you were oh, okay. embarrassed. You can talk the the question if you want to, time. but if you're so smart, why didn't you pick up on it? You were embarrassed the whole time. If you were so smart, why you didn't did I don't generate why a barrier, do I? I just wasted that. Number of videos about you getting flamed. Okay. If you can give out of context, people make, make videos about you getting flamed. It is out of context, buddy. What do you mean it's out of context? Everyone watched the video. What, what are you talking about? Well, then you didn't watch the video. You're not as smart as you're pretending to be. You got flamed. You got flamed. That's all there is to it. 
but like you're, not, not said. you're you're you're, because you, you're saying that I left the stage in anger. I'm saying that the entire time you were being embarrassed by an Asian woman and a woman you said is black and also a white woman, and you couldn't defend yourself against these dimwits. That's what I'm saying. Okay, you also said that I left off of the stage in anger. You looked really bad when you left off the stage. Would you not agree? Are you a punctual man? Did you look bad when you left off stage? Are you a punctual man? I am a punctual man, but you what does that have to do with being embarrassed? If what your multi-million dollar earning mentor told you to be somewhere right. on time for a 7 p.m. podcast. Okay, let's say that- How are all these guys multi-million dollar mentor? When did these guys all get so much money? From where? Why don't you open the cash you've got in storage? Um, I don't know. What was that even for? Oh, for like the little, I don't know, because I need them in the future. That you, you had to leave to make an appointment. Would you be late? Are you kind let's of guy say, that shows up late? Let's say you had to leave to make an appointment. Let's say that is true. I don't it know if it's true. true, but let's say it's true. Let's say it it's is true. true. It, uh, okay, that bro. Still yeah. does not, that still does not so where I get skins at. Look bad. That's what this is. This, no, this no, is you already look bad. This is like Hold you trying to frame yourself as like a superior person. Oh, no, I'm right? appalled. I'm right? appalled. Because if that was the case, I would have mentioned that you have liposuction. I didn't even mention that. I, if that I'm was the case, I'm not hiding that. Where, where have you seen me hiding the fact of that? If Jesus. that was the case, I'd mention that you have hair plugs. Yeah, I mean, where did you where where yeah, do you I'll, see me hiding if, that? If that was the case, I'd mention that you have fake teeth. Yeah, and you where have I, where have if I? If I was those? trying to make myself superior to you, I would mention that you got fake teeth, fake hair, and a fake body. You're basically a Colombian whore. You're a Colombian whore. If I was trying to do that, I would say I'm genetically superior to you in every single way. But instead, we were having a conversation. Oh, yeah, this is horrible. Your jealousy this is caused you to try to throw a slip shot. And I don't like passive aggressiveness. Jealousy of you? Why, why would I be jealous of you? That's why I came back aggressive. I'll tell you why, because I have- Now, hold that thought, ladies and gents. I got a panel I need to do right now. Sorry, it's on my schedule wrong. It's an hour earlier. Also, what is this? Hold on. But this guy's just a fucking little bitch ass, bro. He's, he's always, he's brave on the internet. Now the question is, why did he start with you? Like, I, I know why he started with me, but why did Destiny start with you? Oh, he started with you too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, why, why do you start I, with you? Because what he does, is, uh, that's all he can do is talk shit. What, what's that guy gonna do? Is he gonna fucking do something? Now, I'm a fighter too, man. I fucking wrestled in high school. I did jujitsu for many fucking years. I've been doing kickboxing. I'm not, I'm not, you're really, I saw your hands really good. Um, like, but I'm not boxer, boxer, I'm kickboxer, I'm MMA guy. And this little all he can do is sit there and run his little literal fucking mouth. That's all he can do. That's all his little can do like if this was a hundred years ago we would have swooped into his village and killed him by now <laughs> <laughs> so sorry i'm savage bro i hope you're not recording this <laughs> yeah. all right all right cool well i'm gonna get dressed um all of the things you've paid to get you've paid to get you're a loser and you've pretended to be something you're not. That's why you got embarrassed by those three women because you don't know how to handle women. That's why you fought a case for hitting a woman in Japan because you cannot handle rejection. You've been dealing with it your whole damn life. So you, and you're you mad. Watched. Yeah, I'm watching. You're anything. mad. You're big mad. And you're, you're a fake phony bastard. And we know you're, you're phony because right. you said, oh, if he, he wouldn't say that in front of my face, boy, I would spit in your face and you wouldn't do shit. Yeah, you wouldn't do shit. I would do something so if you said Remember my this. Remember this when you see me. You mm -hmm. better fucking walk up to me with a smile, Mr. Burton. Yes, sir. No, sir. Because now you know where I stand. Oh, God, dude. You, you know, this is going to talk to your phony ass. You think you're a good role and button, model? And button up your motherfucking shirt. No. Button up your motherfucking shirt until you build your chest up, little buddy. No. No, I'm not gonna Button do anything. Button that shit up till you build your chest up. No, actually, I'll, I'll unbutton it even more. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Is this a TMZ shit? I thought, dude, on the phone. Listen, bro, that's some fake snake shit you did, bro. On the no, phone, no, you, you, no, nice. you are pulling some fake snake shit. No, because you don't know you anything about me. Shit. You're trying you your hardest to make You're me look some bad. Fake snake shit. Uh, but the people that I help behind the scenes know me. He writes, MLD, you did the right. 
thing and walking away from the guy who was recording you. It's best to not be confrontational with people who whip out their phones. There you go. There's a supporter. There you go. A uh, shout to Supernova for life. One, he writes, Marquette, I got respect for you, but you're doing too much. MLD is cool. Everyone has their own lane and move accordingly. There you go. You're cool. Uh, Saint ID writes, this is wild. Peace of the Saints. Sebastian writes, Peace of the Saints. This dude is a clown. Just say you were scared of consequences. He not built like that, Quet. He loves flipping the script, clearly. Shout out to none of the above. He writes, damn, why is my alma mater catching strays from the big homie? MLD, you got to do something. <laughs> we got a sense of humor there. No, nah, MLD, honestly, I told you when you called me, I had a lot of respect for the fact that you reached out to me directly. And I really do. But what I don't have respect for is when I played your video, and you said, I never heard of this guy. And that may or may not be true. I don't think it's true, but that's, that's really irrelevant. Yeah that's, irrelevant. yeah, that's irrelevant. Yeah, that's irrelevant. But when you say, oh, I heard he was involved with some crypto scheme, I'm like, okay, well, now we're playing games here. I'm like, okay, well, what was it? Tell me about it. Shit, I want to know. And then you ask me, well, did you? Well, see, that's silliness. That lets me know that you're a fucking goofball. And when you do goofy shit with me, I tend to want to slap your helmet off. That's so why the my coin is up and running. Tell, tell everyone, I, I'm going to give you three minutes. I'm going to give you three minutes. Please explain this scam. What was the scam? Who were the victims? Tell me now, please. So what was it? Was no, no. Tell, tell us. I'm going to put on a, a, a timer. I'm going to give you three minutes uninterrupted. Explain the scam to us. I want everyone to pay attention. Everyone who ever comes for me, they have lies because my record is so pristine. I'm going to put on a fucking timer. Three minutes for you. Explain this whole scam. Give us, tell us the evidence and the receipts. Who are the victims? Tell us. Listen, someone told me you rug pulled the coin. S-A-S-N coin. Is the coin still operating? Yes no, or no? Tell us. Tell us. I don't know. Is the coin operating? You have three minutes. Explain the scam. That's all the information I have. You fucking idiot. You have three minutes. Go ahead. Tell us the scam. I'm done. No, really, you have three minutes. Explain the scam. I want to hear about it. I want to know. Oh, wait. Say in the center, if you want to invite me on to explain in three minutes the scam, uh, that would be interesting to do so. Give me give me a little bit to prepare. I could probably do this. <laughs> I just told you. I could give you and the whole internet three minutes. You know why you can't explain it? Because you're making it up. Okay. And you know why you have to make up shit? It's because unlike you, I don't have a checkered past. Unlike you, I use my name, Marquette Devon Burton. I don't have a checkered past. I have a pristine past of high achievement ever since I was a child. You, on the other hand, are a Colombian whore. You don't measure up. Go ahead, explain the scam. You can't because you're making up nonsense. Mm -hmm. That, my friend, is defamatory. That is libel mm -hmm. when you're making up shit, okay? Now you look like a fucking idiot because I said, okay, well, if I'm scamming, tell everybody. No one who's scamming is gonna say, here's the floor. I'll let you speak uninterrupted to embarrass me. Please embarrass me, expose me. I'll give you a new three minutes because half of it is up. I'm gonna give you a new three minutes. Explain the scam. I already told you. What's the scam? Explain it. Who are the victims? How did it happen? What's the scam? It's three minutes. What was the scam? Who, who are the victims? How did I get money? Mm. How much did I earn? What was the scam? I just told you. Tell us again. Tell us. <clears throat> Saint Center uh, Marquette Devone Burton, the what is an NFT guy, rug pulled two cameras pants. He announced his coin on YouTube. This fucking mouse. Limited supply, SA Assassin, Saints and Center coin. Now available for purchase, just announced at conference today. In Soul Scan, if you look at the TVL, the total value locked. It looks like the pool was at $2,000 for a couple of days before collapsing to zero. Let's see the pool is at $2,000 for a couple days. We're collapsing to zero. If you look at the trade section, there's a bunch of transactions for removing liquidity. The transactions are going to his address, which has his NFTs on them. The world's largest pump and dump. Tell us again, because I missed no. it. I'm not going to participate in this childish activities, dude. 
No, the childish activity is you f-ing lying. And then I say, well, well, explain. And you can't explain because you're a f-ing liar. So your coin that's is operating? Your coin is up and running right now? That's the childish part. You keep on dodging the question. Explain the scam. No, we want to hear about a scam. Right now? You don't need me to talk. Explain the scam. You have Where's three your coin? Minutes. I will not talk at all. What's the scam? Um, I'm, okay, where is the saint and sinner coin? Go on, explain the scam. Come on. It's so funny because he's kind of doing the same thing. I wonder if he learned this strategy from me, right? Because he's doing the same thing. The problem is, guy on the left is a scammer. Mark is a scammer, 100%. But the problem is MLD over here doesn't know how to explain the scam because he probably doesn't understand the space. He doesn't know how to explain it properly. But this is how I caught Mark being full of shit when he accused me of scamming with NFTs, saying he was a technologist, but he doesn't know what NFT is. He doesn't know what any of the technology is either, right? So it's like a scammer scamming another scammer. You look this like a f***ing idiot. Go on, come on. You look come like on. a f***ing idiot. You have this three is minutes retarded. uninterrupted. That's what this I thought. Retarded. That's what I thought. Do you realize that you're making a claim with no evidence whatsoever? I can yes. turn around. It's Mark Wet. It's Mark. I call him Mark or Marquette. Around and say, "Where's the MLD coin?" Do I you, didn't make a coin. The dumb f-ing question you asked me, I can ask I didn't you. Make a coin? What are you talking about? Where is the MLD coin? I never made one. How much? How? I heard you scam people for ten thousand dollars on the MLD coin. What about That's those people? That's <laughs> What? That's the problem with MLD is that he's too passive. I don't know how locked in the personality traits are, but like in terms of like overall personality, like he is like a type B beta guy, but he's trying to present himself as like a traditionally alpha guy. Um, I don't even like to use these terms. These guys just use them. But the problem is um, he, he's like the MLD guy is trying to play a role that he's clearly not suited for. He doesn't have the personality type for it. So it's a little cringe when he walks out here and he tries to do it. It's defamation. Right, exactly, you dumb f- That's what you're doing. All right, so you're going to sue me too? <laughs> I don't sue people for defamation. Where's your coin? Your words about me. All right, you're just going <laughs> to dodge that? <laughs> I'm going to give you three minutes. Explain that scam to me. Explain that scam. Shit, I want to do it again. What was the scam? Explain the scam. And who are the victims? What's the receipt? Explain the scam. So did somebody make a coin in your name? Explain the scam. But I'm asking you the question. You have two minutes to explain dodging the, scam. the question. Look at how stupid you look. You're an idiot. The same questions you're asking, I can ask you. It's called lies. You're ma- you're just trying to reach for something because you don't have any f- information. I'm yielding the floor. You have three minutes. Just explain the scam to us real quick and we'll all be happy. I heard that you had a coin and you rugged. Well, how do you know that that's the case? I heard you had a coin. I heard you rugged. Because do- on the way the back evidence? machine here, that's your lo- that's your logo, right? That's the same the one? Ev- explain to us. Explain on the way back machine? Explain to us. My logo is also on this screen. It's everywhere. Explain. See, let me tell you what you're from. You're from the new school of imbeciles who have such low IQ. You just give a conclusion, but you don't explain. You're like a tranny who says, I'm a woman. And I'm like, well, no, you're hey, not. Okay, look, I'm and not going to stay on the screen. Okay, just to sit here and fucking How are insult you a woman? Me. And he stays here for another 45 minutes. <laughs> Listen, I'm not going to say this stream. You just sit here and insult me, okay? Alex. Like I'm, I'm, I'm being very respectful to you, and you're just, you're calling me a tranny. You're calling me a Colombian whore. When have I ever called? I haven't called you anything disrespectful. No, you just came on here. And no, 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 no. Listen to me now, okay? You don't even, you don't even listen to me because you know what? You are a fucking snake. Because we were all he is a snake, actually, and yeah. you were being respectful and cool. But now I know you were trying to set you me up because you're desperate what you're for views. Saying. You're desperate for views. That's what you have to do. You don't believe what you're saying. No, no, no. I am definitely Jonathan. believe what I'm saying. Jonathan, okay. let me ask you. I definitely believe you, what I'm saying. Jonathan, and do you dude. truly believe, Jonathan, listen, do you truly believe? And I know you've Googled my name. I know no. you have. I didn't even know your I name know until you we talked today during Instagram. Do you truly believe that I pulled a rug pull for any amount of money, whether it's 2000 or $2 million? <sighs> Do you truly believe that? Obviously, now I do not believe it. That's my whole point. It's like, why disrespect me and like just say some dumb shit that's like not even sensible? Because like, the thing, the part. because you were breaking down this thing on valuetainment money and talking lies about me, saying I scampered off of the stage because I was fucking torn up or sad or some shit. 
That's verifiably false. And here, let me pull up some proof for you since you want to trash me on your show. And we, can show. we can definitely check that out. We can no, definitely there's no it definitely out. checking out. I'm going to prove you yeah. wrong right now. Let me tell you this. What I gave was, in, was a perspective, a critical perspective. If you're saying you had somewhere to be, fine. Fantastic. The analysis that I did was over an hour. So I we can't see that, Jonathan. I'm sorry. It's focused now. It's got to wait for the autofocus. That, look at the date. May 8th. That's Adam. I have a hard out at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard okay. Time because I got to be Very on another good. podcast. Very good. So and then he confirms down here. Fantastic. He confirms. Okay. So you, you were wrong on about your stream you about me. You're saying I was wrong about why you had to leave the podcast? Yes. You were wrong. You said I left because I was afraid and I was like I was running away. Let, let me play what I said, and if and if it's inaccurate, I'll I'll do the right thing. Fair enough, fair enough. Let's go back and see what I said, and if it's inaccurate, I'll do the right you thing. You were Is framing that fair? it. You know, listen, you were framing it like the rest of the internet was framing it in a way that I was running away from a confrontation. And I'm a professional. Okay, I'm going to stay on a podcast until Can it's I ask, done. Did it look like you were running away in the footage? No, did it look like you no, because at the at, like I get, sure? again, if you paid attention, which clearly you didn't, he said. Adam said, hey, guys, MLD had already previously said that he has to leave. Okay. He's not walking off of the show. So you're okay. wrong. That's okay. two times you're wrong now. Ooh. Wait, what was the first time? When you said I left the stage and because was I was angry. Time? Okay, the first time was I said you left the stage because you were angry. And then what was the second time? The second time was you're saying there's no context explaining why I was leaving when there clearly was context explaining why I was leaving. The host himself said it. When did I say that? Like that second. 30 seconds ago. No, I didn't say that. But here's the important <laughs> part. Here's the important part. You got flamed for an hour. You're basically saying, Marquette, you were wrong <laughs> about. You got flamed this is for some an Joker hour. v. You're Joker something shit. Else, man. You are something else. I got to say. Listen, all your let's achievements. Let's say, say you had an appointment. That's fine. All let's your say achievements. You had all your education. You you got all flamed your for fitness, an hour. all this stuff. You got flamed for an hour. Completely overseen by the fact that you're you a dishonorable guy. You, you, you got have no for honor. For you have no you honor. You're a guy who got liposuction. Give me a you fucking break. You have you're no honor. You're a guy who honor. got liposuction. If, if you want to make this a trashy, let's fight and get the drives <laughs> upstream, you have no honor. Let's get this to the front page of World Star. Oh, shit. We got some drama on this channel today, boys. That's what you want? We can make it. We can do it. You want a drama? Let's listen, do it. Listen, MLD, you got flamed for an hour. So you're saying Marquette. You gave Who it got flamed for an hour? What are you talking about? By you? No, no, no. Listen, listen. You got to no. listen to understand. Once You're again, listen, the almighty Marquette, the Lord and Savior of the black manosphere, almighty Marquette, bow down. Listen, that's three we're, we're, times we're, he was we're, wrong. We're, we're, we're three we're, times we're, he was wrong now. We're going to mark this break. live stream because Marquette, the Speaking almighty, the black Jesus himself, Whoa, the number the one, the saint himself. You know what, guys? Three times now. Okay. Oh, okay. What are we going to do today, dog? <laughs> Dude, what are we going to do today? What is happening right now? Ooh, I want to share something with you guys. I want to share something. Hey, since we're talking about shit that's completely irrelevant, take a look at my $700 keychain, guys. Woohoo! <laughs> They're hey. losing it, dude. <laughs> you know what? Why'd you bring race into it? I find that strange. Because you are black. I said black Jesus. Yeah, but what does that have to do with anything? Oh yeah, you let let's let's play the race card. Let's get another one. I didn't MLD's you're, 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 you're playing the race card. I I never brought up race. That was you. So that's why I'm asking you. Is like, why'd you bring up race? Oh, uh, let well, however you want to paint me, your lord and savior. But I am just a peasant in I'm your asking, world, my asking, lord, my god, my master, master Marquette, my <laughs> Jesus. Cleanse me of my sins. Oh, I am but a lowly man with fake teeth, liposuction, <laughs> and hair plugs. Bro. Whatever I will I do you. without your masculine guidance in this world? Because everybody's wrong, and you're right. I'm just asking, like, wh why, why bring up race? I don't know. You're so smart. I can't believe you haven't figured that out. 
I'm, I'm, I'm trying to figure that out. I'm, I'm asking you right I'm now. I'm going to do my best. I mean, we got to figure it out. <laughs> we, I don't know. I, I, I actually have a, screen, I have a screenshot here that was shared with me. And mm -hmm. it shows you uh, calling people in words, like N-I-G-G-E-R. Where? Where? Okay, give me a second. Let me pull it up for everybody. Yeah, N-I-G-G-E-R. So I, I thought maybe that's, that's why you brought one. up race two times, even though it's been largely irrelevant. You've got me. Numbers. This is a gigantic gotcha moment. As you can see, yeah. my entire career is spiraling down into irrelevancy. We're just talking about you hitting women. Yes. You said that was out of context. <laughs> You were talking about hitting women out of context? Out of context? I already explained this on my live stream, Dick. So what is the right context in which to hit women? Go watch my live stream. You can figure it out. No, I'm, I got you right here. So I'm just saying, like, if you're going to hit a woman, what's the right context? And I'm telling you right now, go check out my live stream where I clearly explained it. It seems like you're trying to be evasive right now. I mean, you said there's a good context to hit women. What is it? Go watch my live stream and you can see the context. You're right here. You are live streaming right now. Just tell mm -hmm. me what's the right context to hit a woman. Go on my live stream. And Why are you so red right now? Get this guy some beta blockers. Because I was, what, what, I was just nervous? screaming. Are you nervous? When I scream, right I get red. <laughs> when you get exposed for using the N-I-G-G-E-R oh term, you get God. red as well? No, when I scream, like I just said, I don't know if you can't hear me. Are you me. sure you didn't become red as soon as we pulled up this evidence of you <laughs> using the N-I-G-G-E-R word? Because I didn't notice you were red before that. This is the first time I've seen this. This is good. You didn't see it when you wrote it, when you typed it up? I didn't type that up. Ah, uh, that's strange. OK, so the messages about hitting a woman that Alba and Preach showed, did you type those up? Watch my live stream and you can figure it out. It seems as though like you're trying to be evasive, because if I didn't type them up, I would just say, no, Marquette, well, I didn't because, type those up. This, because here's the thing. When we were on the phone, you were, I mean, you're a snake. We're talking right? about right now. It's we're in the, we're right in the now. present. Why do you keep going? Oh, no, no, and we're going to talk about the audience. Uh, we're going to talk about Master this. writes, MLD was dropping the N-word on FNF two weeks ago. I thought he was Ooh. black at the time. I did not say the N-word. N-I-G-G-E-R, fresh and favorite. You get canceled if I said that. I see. I see. Anyways, um... So why is it that you, I'm not asking you to explain the context in which you should hit a woman. I'm just asking why won't you explain the context in which you should hit a woman? Because it's a waste of time because you're disingenuous snake because we were back to all buddy, buddy on the phone talking. No, I wasn't. No, like, well, let me, oh, you're lying. No, 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 no. You're because lying. Phone, you're lying. We were talking. Oh, lying. You were acting buddy, buddy oh, with lying. me. And we were acting like we're going to be friends. Oh, and I said, oh. I was very honest with you. And I said, I wanted to build a bridge and I wanted to have a peaceful resolution to this. And now you're trying so to turn this point, into a giant point, gotcha moment. That's what you said. At what point did it turn into a gotcha moment? At what this point whole did it turn thing into a is gotcha a gotcha moment because you're being a, you're being a jerk. So the, so the, moment the stream started, the moment it started, it was a gotcha moment. This whole thing was a setup. Now that I'm looking at it, another one. No, no, no. Why, why don't you you're take responsibility? You are dude. a Colombian whore. You're a Colombian you're whore. You're not taking responsibility. You're not no. taking responsibility. I'll, you see, I'll if it was here. me, I'll if it was here. me, and and I you, if, it, chat, listen. if it was me, and I called a chick fat in the in the chat, I wouldn't go on a show and pretend I didn't say it. If she said, "Hey, you called me fat in the chat," I'd be like, "That's right, bitch, you're fat." And I, I got liposuction, bitch. You need it too. I would and stand I didn't by. Remember it. And I'm telling you, I didn't remember if it. I slapped a bitch, and somebody's like, "Man, did you slap a woman?" I'm like, "Yes, I slapped that bitch. Yes, I did." But you keep lying, and that's why people got an issue yep. with you. And here's the worst thing about it. You're lying and not taking responsibility because this was a peaceful conversation until you came on here and you disrespected me. Oh, and then at yeah. which point you disrespect me, then I'm not going to pretend to respect you. you now see, I'm I not see gonna everybody pretend. dislikes you. Now I understand why everybody... Pretend. Now I understand. Who's everyone? I thought you never heard of me. <laughs> Who's <laughs> everyone? I thought you never heard of me. On this show. Who's everyone? Tell, since you're so honest, tell us. No. You're so honest. Tell us. I'm not going to give you any more free content. How about that? Since you're so honest, tell us who it was. No. What, are you scared? I thought you were a brave, brave man. You, you slap no. women and no. you call people in words on no. text, on group text. You, you're a brave guy. You tell think us. Marquette was going after him the whole time? No. Nope. Yeah, of course. It's just a setup. That's what he does. Oh, he did the same thing to me. Jeez. Yeah. Jeez. Yeah, I got some more um, text messages here. Should, should we reveal? Okay, we Shout to Byron. He writes... Did he push the guy away or down? That's right. He did say both, didn't he? Mm -hmm. He did say both. He has a great memory, though. 
Uh, maybe he'll tell us later. Alpha writes, Peace of the Saints, I was willing to give MLD the benefit of the doubt, but the fact that he's behaving this silly, I hope the big homie slaps his helmet off in real life. Major Mind and Soul writes, let him rage, Quet. He is, his cat is showing. <laughs> Victor writes, Peace of the Saints, I've admired some of MLD's content, Peace of the Saints. but he needs to admit some culpability. Admit you're wrong and set up the boxing match as a representative and leader of men you claim to be. Wow, he's trying to get this man slept. That wasn't even right. It almost seemed nice, but it was, it was wicked. Shout out to Rakeley. He writes, I'm glad y'all are talking. I hope y'all leave this allies. Y'all have both helped me tremendously with my life. And this is someone I respect. Yeah. This is someone yeah. I respect. Dax is a personal coach. I, I've coached Dax, the swimmer, right? Yes. And yeah. he writes, and are aligned on near, nearly every social issue. Y'all are talking past each other. I've Dax. been trying to tell you from the get-go, but you're, you're pulling this snake shit, bro. Ooh. Let me ask you a question. No, you are pulling the snake shit. Let me ask you this. Grab a glass of water. I'll be right back. Let me ask you a question, Jonathan. A sincere question. Damn, he right big back. mad. He big mad. Right. Good Lord. I just want to know, why is it the case that there's so much dirt on you. How old are you? Like, how long have you lived that there, there's this much fucking dirt on you? What, what is your age? I thought you know all things. You should know that. I'm just asking a simple question. What's your age? No, I thought you should. I'm, I'm going to play the game you want to play. You know what? Dude, you're just, the, honestly, your I'm age? really glad. I'm really glad. And I know why. Now I really What's understand. What's your age? What's your age? Now I really understand. Okay. So you, because you want to do a big gotcha moment. No, I'm asking, and what's your just, age? Uh, let, me, let me just talk to the we audience. Might the okay. We might be the I same age. We might be the same age. I this guy up, okay? And let me show you the screenshot. Why I'll won't show you say your age? What I'll is the issue here? I'll talk about the truth here. What is this guy? He's a woman? This guy thinks he's a middle-aged white woman. He won't say his age. Do you want to make peace? I told you. That's the whole reason I wanted oh, to make no. peace with you. That's why I called you. <laughs> I'll tell you this. I felt and I observed. You asked me something that would clearly be inflammatory because it's publicly known not to be true. You have zero evidence of it and you're repeating the words of a homosexual person who was angry. No, 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 and no, 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 stop, 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 stop. I wasn't repeating you're destiny. I was repeating He's a friend the only person in Tokyo. Who's ever said that. No, 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 I was repeating a friend in Tokyo. Would you like to see the screenshot? He, Destiny is the only person who's ever said that because you know where that lie right, came so from. Why it are you not answering Destiny. the questions? Why are you not trying to like have a decent conversation? He's trying to argue with a skit so he doesn't realize. Do you want to see the screenshot? What, what yes would your no. screen? Your screenshot means nothing because Destiny it does, originated because you're the idea that I repeated this because I heard it from Destiny and that's oh, not okay. true. Let's say you didn't hear it from Destiny. Where the lie originated was with Mo Destiny. That's the bottom line. Mo Lestiny. Okay. Well, that's not where I heard it. Fine. Okay. You heard it from your friend in Tokyo. Fine. The lie originated with destiny. It's a lie. You have no evidence of this. No one does because it didn't happen. So you're talking about something that's slanderous and you asked me a stupid question. Why? Okay. So listen, we're going to clear things up because you're not just going to sit here and slander me on the stream. Okay. Ooh. I didn't slander get it from what? destiny. Okay. We just, that we just the screenshot that. right there. It's going to autofocus. I said, you sure he's a crypto scam guy? Google search, Stain Center rug pull. Okay. Right. And since you researched it, what's the evidence? I'll give you three minutes if you believe I in it. I called you after this happened. Okay. So I'm, I'm just going to, I'll tell you this. I if called you, you after it, this happened. If, if you believe that, I kid you not, I will give you as much time as you like to prove it. I'll let you do your research and every, I'll give you as much time as you like to prove it. Well, look, dude. And I'll tell, I'll tell you, you why. Because when you live a whole, hold on one second. I'll tell you why I would, I would have given you that time. Because when you live an entire life of discipline every single day, and you've earned your reputation, I've never pretended to be someone I'm not. I've never exaggerated anything that I've done. I've only spoken to the facts, the truth of the matter. So right. I will not have my good name sullied or soiled by anyone. And I would right. present any man the opportunity to bring any evidence against me. And that is why we know my reputation is pristine because every time I provide the opportunity, no one ever has receipts. They never have evidence. And I asked you your age and you wouldn't say your age because I'm saying we might be the same age. Because that being you, the case, you have proven, there's so much dirt on you and there's no dirt on me. It's because the proven, way I've lived my life. Okay, but you have proven one thing and one thing only. You're a dishonorable man. 
because Ooh. we on the conversation you framed this call as if we're going to get on stream and be peaceful buddy buddy and now you do this whole gotcha thing and you can sit there and you can to lie to your audience but that's what happened Everyone i watched. said let's get on the stream let's Everyone hash watched. it out i said we should have a bridge between the two of us because i said it's better okay. for men to come together than mm -hmm. men to fucking be at each other's throat but you're causing more division now how the fuck do you think that's there, going to be there's no division. It's just you and I. I'm one man and you're one man. Okay, the only reason a rift grew, the only reason a rift grew is because no, you said no, no, something. No, 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 no. You're not going to. No, 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 no. Because I said that offline. I said it offline. I did. Cause what, I said, what's the evidence? What'd you I, say? I said, you look like a scuffed TI. And then I said, I said something about a crypto scam on our call. And you're like, yeah, it's cool. No problem. No, let's let's, no, have, a, let's a have a call. That's a I'm going to send you, and you're like, I'm going to send you the StreamYard link. Everything's that's cool, bro. And now you pull this kind of shit. And now that's this is just going to make other people look like you would be like, yeah, I don't want to fucking work with this no, guy because he does this fake clown. shit. You're Listen, you can, say whatever you, you can say whatever you want to say. You can say whatever you want to say, but this is some snake shit you, you pulled on me here. Liar. This is no some one snake shit, bro. I'll tell you why no one will believe you, MLD. Here's this why no one will believe you. They saw you on a podcast for more than an hour deny that you called a girl fat. You denied that you called her fat. You said you didn't remember it. They saw I you didn't lie remember for it. over an hour. I didn't remember it, okay? Well, I don't care what you say. I don't care what you say. You're wrong. I don't remember her. Oh you called God. a girl fat three times. No, I didn't. You did. You I didn't you never call her that three times. I said, who is this chubby girl? Ha, ha, ha. You She's remember now, though. Pounds to have you remember now. Because I showed you the screenshot. You see, anybody in the chat with an IQ you can see now. that you're a fucking dirtbag. So you remember now. This, fine. But Shout here's the thing. Above I'm, I'm like, going to go now. Because I promised you one hour. He says, I just one hour. guys for accusing him of no, 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 no. Scam and you will get peace. I approved you. I promised you. He said, just apologize for accusing him of this crypto scam and you will get peace. Is that your terms of it? That was the only reason things went left. No, dude, you're a liar, that's bro. That's, that's honestly, that's disingenuous and you're a liar. I'll tell you what. If you, you don't want liar. peace, if you don't want peace, I don't need peace. I'll destroy you. If you cool. don't want peace, I don't need peace. Cool. It's in Go your interest because you're weak. Enemies around the world. Let you're me know how that works out for you. You're weak. It's in your interest. I Dude. will destroy you. You're Read weak. This. Read this. You're weak. Read this. Read this. If you can't stop a double leg takedown, I'd love to see you try. You're weak. Read this. I'd love to see you try to attempt one. I'd love to see you make eye contact with me. I'd love that. Rakely writes, I'm telling you, you guys are talking past each other. Rakely, this man has fucking liposuction, fake fucking teeth. I'm talking to a man who's in his 30s or 40s and he got dentures already the f is this man's a colombian whore man got so fucking what, what fake hair to, if i wanted to straighten we're my not teeth on the out. same level if i wanted I to still, my man, teeth out, listen let me let me what teach you something. i should have got some braces you what you need to know let so me teach you are better you than veneers no you need to learn something better than veneers because you, you got braces right you no, I didn't. It. You need to learn. You so need what, to learn. So what, should, wait, so what should somebody do if they have imperfect so teeth? No, 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 no. What I should somebody do if they have imperfect teeth? Because you're, you're, I, I corrected yourself. myself. Be I yourself. No, no, no. I wanted nice. I wanted a perfect white smile that was straight. What should you I have done? You teeth to look like mine naturally, look, but that's fine. Calm down. Let me tell you. No, something. no, no. Answer the question. <laughs> I like how the Mark guy's running his teeth are natural. Disingenuous. Jesus. You teach me to get a fucking liposuction. You're Kanye West. You teach men to go get a, a liposuction. Yeah, bro. I teach them to do abdominal crunches. I You're, teach them to do pull-ups. I teach them to run for miles upon miles. Don't look like a hard man. Be a hard man. You teach men to fake in front. You are what a you. You exemplify the worst qualities in women. You know what? You exemplify know me. the worst qualities in women. You're a you faker. You don't even know who I am. You're a faker. No one. You, you don't know who you, you are. Know me. You don't know who you are. You, you don't, don't know. know who I am, bro. But you, you, you don't know who you are. No, I know exactly who know. I am. No, you have I not exactly who I am, and I know that the men that I help in the Masculine Empowerment Network you and all of my things, you can't help I yourself. have helped thousands of men, thousands and thousands and thousands of men, thousands of men. I on my own honor. Okay, We're talking past each other. I'm telling you. His teeth I look natural. Willing to make peace with uh, no, you're retarded, and I'm not even going to entertain this argument in chat. At the very least, he's had braces and um, bleaching. 
if not more. If you think that this is a natural smile, you are beyond help, you've been poisoned by society, I'm not having a, I'm not even gonna have the argument with you. Uh, nobody has no crotting, nothing on the bottom and top, naturally, and, um, and teeth that are that way. At the least, it's bleaching plus braces, um, if not veneers themselves, if not veneers themselves. Uh, if you think it's totally natural, you're fucking retarded. I don't know what to say to you, sorry. If you, if you acknowledge what you did, but if you persist in lying, there is no peace. What did I acknowledge? What do you want me to acknowledge? The conversation went left, and I turned up on you when you made a libelous defamatory accusation about me. That's when it went left. Honestly, okay. when we talked about it offline, and we yeah. talked about that offline, you could deny that, but we did talk about that offline. He writes, none of okay. the above 101. And on just this stream, Marquette, I have told you numerous times I apologize for the crypto thing because I'm a man of honor. And I, you know what? And here's the thing too. I don't hide the fact that I got hair transplant. I don't hide the fact, I made a fucking documentary about my liposuction. And I don't hide the fact that I have veneers. And I would never do this to you. I would never fucking be a snake and call you up and be all buddy buddy on the phone and then snake God you on a live stream. Me. That's you the come. snake. You're acting I don't like your money. You you're, you're, you're a, you're a perfect in a example. This is a perfect you example to your worst, audience. Worst you can have all the education in the world. You can have all the money, but you can have no class because that's this. Please, this is class. You, you are a Jersey Shore whore. What are you Classless. talking about? You're Jersey Shore. What Classless. Are you, what are you no talking class. about? No you're class. Like you're in an ugly ass Louis V shirt with the with it buttoned down with a fucking Guido class. chain on. No classless. And a fucking uh, I'm homosexual earring. Give me a break here. Classless, bro. Great. Talk, talk. That's fine. Say you can slander right me all you want. It was super polite before the accusation. Do you and, deny and that? The accusation is fake because I talked to you about it offline. Do you deny that? I talked that? to you about it offline. It's fake. It's you fake. You know that? it. You're just doing this for clout. Do you Ooh. deny that? It is fake. It was. You are this, fake. Major mind and soul rights. You, you have snaked me, and I want to make it very clear on the, the audience members. Do this you have man my, has you, snaked you me. Deny this? This man has snaked me. And you deny you this. Listen, once a snake, always a snake. <laughs> You're the only person that we've seen live for hours on end during a live Once stream. a snake, always Here's a snake, question. bro. Was it, as it's written here by people who are observing, it was super polite before the accusation. Once Do a you snake, deny that? always a snake, bro. You're one of those I, dumb people. You think if you repeat something, it becomes true. You're like, one no, plus one no. is three. One like plus you, one is three. Like you did earlier when you had the three minute time. Service. You have three minutes. You have three minutes. You have three minutes. Okay. I was giving you time. To Anyways, talk. You, look, you I gotta go. Okay, because I gotta. I, I'm invited on a real podcast. I'm gonna. I'm, I'm noticing gonna, a pattern I'm, here. I'm, I'm noticing a pattern. No, 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 no. I, no, no, no. Take that back. Take that back. I promised you one hour. Did I not promise you one hour? Run. Okay, you're gonna lie to your audience again. On valuetainment, and now he's lying here. That's what it says. No, 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 no. Tell your audience. MLB just apologized for the accusation, and we can be square. I promise you, we can be square. Okay, I apologize, but I've already apologized throughout this show multiple times. Please let the audience know that I am not scampering off because I because you say you're you're man with honor, and I told you one hour, and it's now one hour thirty eight minutes and thirty seven seconds. The timestamps in the top left. The, the timestamp. Right? I don't want to interrupt you. Are you yielding the floor? Right. So first things first, here's the deal. Please, it, please acknowledge that I'm not scampering off, okay? I told you I have to catch a flight here in a few hours because I'm flying to London because I'm going to be in the Just Pearly Things podcast. <laughs> Are Did you I yielding not... the floor? I just don't want to interrupt you. Right. So that's the first step. Did you please acknowledge to the audience I'm not scampering off in cowarding way. I... In fact, I said this earlier, you agreed to appear for one hour. In fact, you asked me, I said an hour. And you said, yeah, that's fine. Settled. Right. Part two, you need endure, to tell the endure, audience the endure, truth. Endure, endure, that endure, I was endure. telling you I wanted to come on here and make peace. And now you have this whole docket of evidence against me. And I said, what we should do is let's review the value attainment money together. I think we should build a bridge. And you did this whole gotcha moment on me, bro. Tell your audience the truth. I'll be clear that everyone knew that I listed a roast of you to occur tonight at 10 I don't 10 care. No, no, I'm talking man <laughs> to man what we had. What we had. Don't, Tell your audience. Interrupt. Don't interrupt. Don't interrupt. I'm going to be very clear. Don't interrupt. 
My integrity is not questioned by anyone. No one would ever believe that I lied because I've been honest my whole life. I had a roast of you scheduled since the morning. Therefore, a dossier was being prepared on you. You reached out to me. We spoke on the phone. To make peace. This is not peaceful. Listen, are you going to talk while I'm talking or am I going to talk? Go ahead. Did you notice when you were talking, I said, do you yield the floor? I didn't want to interrupt you. Right. <laughs> He's Would getting low brown so hard. So that I can recount things. I will not say anything until you say you may speak, MLD. All right. <laughs> Why is I it so beta? I even confirmed with you. I said, hey, if you're reaching out to me to, on a, in a peaceful way, I won't even do the live session tonight. I won't even do it. But if you're reaching out, I'll sue you or any tough talk. I encourage you to sue me and I will absolutely do the roast and I encourage you to do whatever else you like to do. You said, oh, no, 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 it's in peace. I said, fantastic. You tried to explain a number of other things. We had a, a, a you know, the conversation was a bit like uh, squirrely. I'd ask you some questions you didn't answer. And then I believe it was my idea to have you come on. You believe it was your idea to come on. One thing you did say, which you just spoke to, is that you want to review the value tainment footage. And then I said, well, let's review the one I did. You want to review the original? I said, let's review the one I did. Regardless, you came on, we had a reasonable conversation. We popped up a two, uh, one unrelated clip and then we went to the value tainment bit. Things were going swimmingly. And then there was a breaking point in which you defamed me. From there, it went south. The difference of opinion is, you don't believe you defame me at that point. I'm certain you defame me at that point. That's a point of disagreement. That's fine. That's why we're saying at this point, we call it water under the bridge. Is there anything aside from the breaking point that you disagree on with what I just recounted? Oh yeah. And the last piece, when you say like, I brought up a dossier and the fact that I had to email that image to myself shows the fact that I didn't have everything queued up because I did not plan to roast you. I sent that to myself during this stream because at that point I was like, fuck it, you disrespecting me, it's nuclear warfare. But had I planned on roasting you, that shit would have been queued up, believe you me. I didn't plan on roasting you. I My planned plan, on going back to the footage boy. and having a conversation. At the point in which you defamed me, then I was like, okay, now you're in the frying pan. We don't have to agree there. That's the facts. The facts. I yield the floor. Okay. so. The reason you're making this claim of me defaming you is because you asked me a question and I asked, said, I well, heard. Hey, Mr. Girl, thanks for the 10 gifted subs, buddy. I didn't say, because you're saying defamation. I didn't say, Marquette, I would not disrespect you to the level that you've disrespected me on this stream. And I would not come on your stream and say, hey, bro, you're a crypto scammer. That's what you're trying to say that I said. You're saying that I defamed you and I clearly asked you a question. OK, and despite all of this slant, this this awful thing that you just try to put me through. OK, I still want to work with you because I think us two coming together will be better and helping men than sitting here and having this catty TMZ fighting bullshit that I was not know because if, if I knew you were going to do this. And I knew this was the kind of person you were. I would not agree to this. You keep on going back with that. Like, do you want smoke or do you not want smoke? If you're if you're here to, I, this not an insult. I, a quote from you. I you said, I didn't quote, you but you did yet. you scam? You I, said, and I quote, but did you scam? You said that, and that's when it went left. And that you sir, said that, Marquette. That is a question, not an accusation. But that's the question that made you look like a fucking fool, and that's the one that put you in the frying pan. Sure. So now you can go back to the drawing, bo drawing sure. board and figure it out. Sure. Right now, I don't want to hear any bullshit. If you want smoke, it's smoke. If I you don't, do talk not... like you don't want smoke. Listen. I need you to talk like you don't want an issue. Because right now, it sounds like you're, you're being um, disingenuous. You're equivocating. I need you to be clear. Uh, Portia writes, Peace of the Saints, MLD, I follow you. But you need to apologize for that crypto comment. Do you recognize that name? That's someone that says they follow you. No. That, that's a fan of yours. That's 220,000 followers. Yeah, but you don't have 220,000. I think both of these guys bought their channels, by the way. 
super chatters. I wish you did. Neither but, do you. Right, and I wish I did. I'm not saying that sarcastically. I'm saying I wish you did. Shit, I wish you'd be more, I wish I'd be more, I wish we'd all be more successful. My this point is, is that the, this is my point is the people who, awful. listen, my point is the people who super chat are about what, two to 5% of the total subscriber base. That's what I'm saying, you might recognize the person. Is everybody to look up what they did? Yeah. Well, he's got 100,000 subs. He's pulling a cup, maybe one to 300,000 views per month, maybe. I don't know what happened this month. If you bought it views or had one viral video, but, or is this when I fought with him? September of last year? I don't even remember. You quote asked me, did I scam? A person of my stature, like you can play that with different people, but someone of my stature, I'm not gonna pretend to be small when I'm not. Right. Did you scam? That's a slap in the face. I, you said you were in medical sales. I don't know if in the professional environment you would address men of respect and ask them I such never a said I was in medical sales. I said I worked in the medical device industry. Okay, my apologies. What were you doing there? Why do you, you don't Take even do shit. All you need to do is cut. just say I'm a loser, I'm uneducated, <laughs> I'm stupid. <laughs> oh no, that means he had a bad job. I was just trying to say. get the right information. I apologize. I mean, Listen, here's, here's, what I'm saying. I, here's the thing. I apologize now. You said there's going to be peace and you're still talking shit. No, it's because you keep on bullshitting. All the, all we're saying is apologize for you insulting me with a bullshit ass question. I will say I will not insult you moving forward for we have buried the hatchet. That's all there needs to be. That's it. That's it. There's nothing deep here. I don't gain anything by putting you down. Clearly you do. That's why you set this whole thing up. Oh, he's so See, sad. there you go. You don't want peace. No, I do, because what you yeah. do, we called on the phone, and I and I was super we're nice to phone. you. I was super cordial. I was so nice. What happened, Listen, bro? And now we're coming up on two hours. Not, is it cordial if I asked you, did you scam? Is that cordial? To you, you have been not cordial at all with Listen, me. Listen, I'm asking you, is that cordial to you? If I ask you, did you scam someone? Is that cordial? It's a question because I didn't know the answer. Yes or no? Is that How, so? <clears throat> you're mad at me for no one's mad. I'm asking you about is that, you said a you're crypto bored. scam. So how was I supposed to frame that? So you thought that your role today was to come on here and ask me if I've done a crypto scam? Since you're so cordial, why didn't you ask me that on the telephone? I did. No, I, you no, I said, I, I you said, fucking I, lied. I Give me a Sorry. fucking break. Uh, bro. If okay. you asked me that on the telephone, why would you ask me again on the live stream? All right. Here's the deal. It's now no, if up you asked hours. me that on the telephone, why would you ask again on the live stream? Oh, I, okay, I made a mistake. Uh, a lie or a mistake? A mistake, not a lie. It was a mistake. Okay, you think I would, do you, you really think I would continue to come at you right now after going, it's almost two hours we're going here, bro. I promised you one hour. I've been staying out of courtesy. And I gave you my word, man to man, one hour. It's not okay. man to man because well, you just said it's, that you it's asked 1 me on the phone. It's 1.55 a.m. Listen, 1.55 a.m. Bro, get the fuck out of here. Go, get the fuck right. out of here, man. I'm tired of this. It, there's so no reason. I, I, I just want to make it clear. I came here to make peace. No, you had a chance to make peace and you keep fucking lying. And I'll tell everyone a lesson. You cannot make peace with a lying fucking rat because you can't take his word that it's peace. They're going to betray you when they get a chance. <laughs> Look at how sad he is. You can't take a motherfucker who can't even sit here as a man and take responsibility for asking a dumbass insulting question. Get the fuck out of here. I don't want peace with you. Get the fuck out of here. It's beef. Fuck you and get the fuck out of here. Uh, peace of the saints. <laughs>